This is Heather Edom, and today my tip is something that seems like it should be fairly obvious, but I didn't even think to use it until about halfway through the school year this year, and I've known about it for about a year. It's using Google Forms and Flubero to grade the forms that students submit. So I teach environments the unit, the science environments unit, to all four fifth grades at my school, and at the end of each time that I teach it, each section that I teach it, I give them a mini test just to see if they know the vocabulary and learned the basic concepts of what we talked about. So I always had the kids do it on paper and pencil and then I would grade it and then I would hand the test back to the teacher. It was kind of a pain because it just took a long time and above and beyond what I was already doing with my own class. So I don't know why I didn't think of this earlier, but about halfway through the year I decided to put the test on a form in Google. These are literally the questions that are on the test um, that they were taken with paper and pencil and they had to answer it. Each student signs in under their own um, Edina Apps account, so they have this in their portal. Um, and then when they respond, their responses are all here. Hopefully there we go, maybe. And then you can open up a spreadsheet or in a sheet that shows all of their responses. And once you have all of their responses in a sheet like this, they, again, you still have to grade it. So all you do is you go into add-ons and you click Flubru and I've already graded this one, but you, it'll say grade assignment. And when you do that, you have to pick um, which one is going to be the answer key. I went through and took the test myself and put in the correct answers, of course, and it asks you the grading options, how much is worth, how much each thing is worth, each question I should say. And then it'll go through and they'll say, which one do you want to be the answer key? And I just looked for my name and I click on my name and then I continue. And it grades your assignment for you. And the great thing about this too is you can share the answer key and the grades with the classroom teachers that the kids belong to. Or if you have a teammate like mine, she likes everything on paper. She's not exactly into technology. So I would just print this sheet up for her so she could see how her students did in the science unit. Um, and then here you go. So it just shows you how everyone did, tells you how many points they got out of um, I think I had 11 total, well yeah 11, and then their percentage and how many times they, they submitted the test and their actual answers for each one. And it works out, like I said, it's pretty nice, it's easy, it saves you a lot of time, it's all in one place and it makes it easier to share with your teammates instead of giving them a bunch of papers to look at later.